Hey guys, so today I want to do quickly a video here comparing Siri, Vals, and Google Now on my Android smartphone versus my iPhone 5. Yeah, so let's do this quick little comparison. I made this on the gym or a earlier edition <clears throat> also of iOS, uh, but this is the final. So let's check it out and ask a few questions and compare them a little bit. So let's start. What's the weather like? Here's the forecast between today and Saturday. So that was kind of like the same here <clears throat> with Google Now here versus the um, the iPhone 5 with Siri. Uh, I think that they were around the same there. So very, very good speed on both. And let's try another thing. Open camera. So you can see yeah, this one immediately opens it up. While here we have an option to uh, opt out and then it will open it up. Pretty sweet. Now of course here we have to go back. Here we can just hold in the home button to get back. What is 15 plus 15? Looking. The answer is 30. <clears throat> so one cool thing here is that some apps here you immediately get like a calculator and now we can start to type our own little thing 45 times blah 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 45 plus or times 32 checking on that the answer so is 100 45 times 32 let me check that the answer is 100 45 times 32 checking my sources there we go the answer is 1440 so you can still like continue to ask it uh, but you don't get like a widget um, you know, that you get in here uh, so you might prefer your own way set alarm at 11 p.m. Your alarm set for 2300 hours. And you can tap here on both to go. See here, can we get into that? No, I can't go into that app there. Pretty random, I think. Uh, let's continue. Let's continue. So, <clears throat> let's, let's try this one. Tell me something. I'm really more of a listener. So this one is of course a little bit more chat chitty chatty uh, while this one we just usually search for it sometimes bring up a widget find me the closest McDonald's this restaurant named McDonald's looks pretty close to you wow that's pretty good from both pretty pretty good and impressive here from both this one will open the app uh, wow that's some pretty impressive stuff <laughs> So, very, very impressive yeah, from both. Of course, yeah, Apple use their own Apple Maps. But you can see both here did find the location uh, to that place, uh, which is pretty, pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. Pretty nice stuff. So both can work as a McDonald's finder or any other fat burger place, maybe. Okay, let's try another one. Google fat cats. Searching Google for fat cats. So this one also added Google, which I think is a little bit weird because if you say Google fat cats, then you should kind of know <laughs> that, uh, that I'm trying to do just fat cats. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's fun. Google dogs. Searching Google for dogs. So of course this one is quicker in terms of searching Google because this one has to open a, a, a another app while this one, well, while Google is a little bit integrated already in Google now, it's good here on the name. <clears throat> Let's uh, try another little thing here. So. Oops. Remind me that I need to do something productive today. 
Here's your reminder. Wow. Shall I create it? Pretty sweet. Console. So you have also reminders on both here, so you can have a reminder in here. Okay then. Tomorrow, today, weekend and everything. Pretty impressive stuff on both platforms here. Um, note to self, I really need to get a new job. Noted. So you have both notes here. Pretty good stuff actually. So. You can judge for yourself which one you think is the the more awesome one. I think both are pretty awesome. Both are very, very good. You can ask them a lot of things. And in these new updates, it's really starting to get impressive how good voice assistants could be. So just quickly look at that. Hopefully you did enjoy this quick look here at Siri versus Google Now. And you can judge for yourself which one you think is the best. Have a good day.